Heidi has a high lift blonde balayage with a silver toner all over. Today we are going to do a spiral perm. Before we get started, our video, The Guide to Creating the Most Popular Perm for 2020, is similar to the winding style used in this demo. Please reference our video, The Guide to Choosing the Perfect Perm Rod, to understand the nuance between perm rod sizes. Let's get started! Our first step is to spray in our pre-curl porosity equalizer on the ends where it is needed. With a spiral perm, smaller rods are used to create the tight springy curls that are desired. The trick to this perm is lots and lots of small sections for maximum amount of rods. Starting at the nape of the neck, carve out one inch sections and wind perm rods vertically. We have chosen to alternate gray and white rods for Heidi's perm. Each section can be wound in the same direction, or you can wind from the outside in. It's your choice. As a stylist, you'll understand that using different winding patterns can create curls that are multi-directional, which can add volume and dimension. Make sure that all the perm rods are fastened on top. Hey! sections with the same winding pattern until you reach the crown. your section should arc with the shape of the head. remaining. Okay, now we move on to the side sections. Slice your sections and wind the rods backward vertically.
winding these sections until your remaining top section is approximately 2-3 to three inches wide. From here we switch to all grey rods for maximum curls and volume on top. This section is a bit of a free for all. Carve out your sections and place your perm rods, keeping in mind you will need lots of them. Remember to keep your perms well saturated while winding. You can continue to wind them vertically or you can wind them horizontally, whichever way fits. section will be sliced in two sections, wound in opposite directions to create volume on top. Here we have it, last section. is lots and lots of small sections for maximum amount of rods. And here we have it, your wrap is complete. As Heidi's hair is processed and fragile, we are placing sticks between the perm rods and the bands to ensure there is no breakage. Our video, The Guide to Choosing the Perfect Perm Solution, guides you to what you need in every scenario. In Heidi's case, we chose a solution for high lift blonde hair. Perming this type of hair requires an acid perm pH balance of 7.9 or lower. Processing time was 15 minutes. Please note, the active ingredient in perm solution is ammonium thioglycolate. This will wash out toner and lighten darker colors, particularly on the ends. A semi-permanent or low peroxide color can be applied 48 hours after perm services. Voila! The end result, tight springy spiral curls. This perm is very low maintenance. Less is best. A small amount of gel or mousse can be used sparingly as not to weigh down the curls. You can let this perm dry naturally or use a diffuser for more volume. When the curl is dry, lightly separate the strands to unfurl the curls for maximum volume. Hey guys, don't forget to hit that like button.